and I'm a violin teacher and on today's lesson I will teach you how to play on the violin the song Kukabura. So get your violin, to your violin, get your bow, put some rosin on the bow and let's get started. First I'm going to play the song from beginning to the end so you have an idea how it sounds and then I will explain measure by measure how to play it. So we count by twos, one, two. And that was the whole song played from the beginning till the end and I repeat it twice. So now I'm going to explain to you how you can practice measure by measure. So starting with the first measure we have the notes A and B and we have the rhythm pattern tika tika ti tika. So it's A A A A B B B. So we know the A the open string is zero and B is the first finger on A string. So now we have to check the bow. We have detache. We play those four notes, the tika tika detache. So we play the detache note in the middle of the bow. Okay, so from this point to this point. Again. So we have to make sure we play the detache using our elbow, open the elbow. So we open and we close, we open and we close. So make sure you're not playing like that using your fingers or your wrist. Your arm should be straight and you're just opening your elbow and closing. So that's the movement that you have to do on the derache. The second measure is T, 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 T and the notes are A and F sharp. So we have A open string, A and then F sharp on this string with the second finger. If you want, you can play the G and see if the G is close to the F sharp, that means your F sharp is correct. And we have your separate notes and the gato. One more time. So we are connecting now measure one and two together. Then we're going to measure three. We have tika tika ti tika, the same pattern as the first measure, and the notes are F sharp and G. And then we have the fourth measure, F sharp and D, and the rhythm pattern is ti 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 ti. So one more time. So let's play one more time from the beginning till the end, the first line. You can play slower if you can play it this fast. So we can play one more time slower.
On measure 5, we have D, quarter knot, one beat, and then we have Tika Tika, which is another one beat. So D. So that was measure 5 and 6, and measure 6 is A, quarter knot, one beat, and then Tika Tika for A, B, A, G. So one more time, measure five and six together. As you see, when I'm playing the tikas, I'm using the tip of the bow and then the bottom of the bow. I'll measure seven. The rhythm pattern is ta, tika, ti, ti, and the notes are F sharp and D. So we find the F sharp on this string. And there we go, we start playing. Rhythm and the beat is one, two. <laughs> Measure eight is ta and rest. So one beat, it's we play the note, and one beat is the silent. So the first time I was tapping the rhythm on my tambourine, but now I would like to tap the beat on the tambourine, which is one, two, one, two. So let's get started with the beat. Two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two. children to create their own actions. You may be surprised at their wonderful imagination. Here we are at the end of another lesson. I hope you enjoyed the lesson and this was helpful to you. Thank you for watching, liking, sharing and subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate it. See you next time.